Hey, welcome back with Let's Play Donkey Country 2. It's Tame Man 2037, and right now we're going to tackle Chainling Chamber. We're getting towards the end of essentially the last world. The next world has one level in it. I don't really, I don't really call that a world, but this level is a little bit of a bitch. Most, it's called Chainling Chamber for a reason because you basically, it's basically just all maneuvering these things. Which, I don't really call that platforming, I call that maneuvering chains. Because platforming and plot involves jumping, and... We're doing a little bit of jumping right now, but not a ton. That's okay, you can just hit that B. Alright, that's a better jump there. Did I go the right way? Oh wow, looks like I... I thought this was like an extra way, but... Apparently not. That guy's cool, you know, just t t he takes your lives away. And they put him in front of Banana, it's not even really worth it. I mean, that's kind of a douche move, rare. Uh, Cannonball, gotta find there. Let's see if I can find that. Maybe it's behind this guy. Okay, see? See? You could've just put a Banana guy in the last part. Not a lives guy. I mean, we have, like, 37 lives, but that's not a big deal. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the, the Just Cause 2 playthrough. I mean, not really a playthrough, but showing you what it's all about. Like I said, I'm not going to play the whole game, because that game's gigantic, and it pretty much just consists of me running around, exploding shit, getting mad at the computer, and the enemies shooting at me, at the government. And then who isn't angry at the government? I guess I'm not really, because my life's good. But if your life's not good, I'm sorry. Alright, here we have two different paths we can take. Uh, I don't feel like waiting for the barrels to line up properly, so... Well, I guess... Oh, wow, jeez, okay. It's a little simple, tough thing you can put in. If you want to get the O, we don't really need that. So you need the barrels or hooks. I went to... I just had to go the hooks route. Let's see, the level not as bad as I remember it, like most levels. But maybe, I mean, we're only about halfway through the level. <sighs> see, uh... There we go, sweet. I feel cool, guys. Bonus thing. See, they make you dodge an obstacle to get to the bonus thing. Not the bonus thing, the, the halfway point. Why do I call it a bonus thing? I don't know. I guess everything's a bonus because I'm playing this awesome game, and just playing it's a bonus. Ha ha. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, but they don't even put any... What is the point of these guys? Why do they put those there? I don't understand that. K barrel. Honestly, they put those sword guys there. They 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 pose no threat whatsoever. Ah, whatever. We'll just keep going up the tower. Lots of castle levels. Ah, shit, those bees. What's up here? Oh, these generally aren't too hard to dodge. Definitely easier than the bees to dodge. Just go up and then go down. I think those birds could maybe have something better to do. Alright, let's keep going up. Now the bees go in circles, and then they put that sword guy down there. Now let's rewind a little bit. I think I've been doing a bit less safe stating, so I hope you guys appreciate that. Okay, we just... Alright, that, was... that wasn't too tough. Ah, damn it. Okay. You know, maybe they could make the cannonball go down a, lit, a bit less fast. Because, like, if you don't know what direction it's going to come from, you pretty much got to guess. Well, whatever. Hope you're enjoying the playthrough. Like I, like I said, I want to maybe diversify my portfolio a little bit. All I have are rare games. A little bit of Just Cause in there. So if there's something you guys want me to play next, and then I've also been having debates with people like, what should be in an LP? Should it be... Should it be games I don't know and have a bit more surprise factor where I'm playing along with you? Or does it, should it be a game I know where the commentary might not be as good because if I'm not surprised, I'm not going to be really complaining or at anything? So I was thinking either I could play through Super Mario 64, that wouldn't be long. I was thinking maybe... That's a game I know well. I was also thinking Super Mario Galaxy 2, a game I... I've really never played through. 
Might be a bit longer too, 120 stars, and the levels are a lot longer. Right now I'm leaning towards Super Mario 64, but if you really want me to play through Mario Galaxy, I'll do that. We'll just see what happens. I can also play through more rare games if you want, if you guys are enjoying that. I could play through Knockout Country 3 or 1. Probably 1 would be the best. Because 3 is a bit, bit longer and tougher, and I'll be honest, I haven't beaten the final boss in that game either. I certainly haven't got all the bonus coins, no surprise there. Alright, Toxic Tower. Probably the, the last level in this world. Level that a lot of people bitch about. Which, of course, I'm gonna say it's easy now and then just totally suck it up. See, like, like that. I don't, I don't really know what happened there. And then acid. Apparently, I just didn't jump on the guy properly that one time, but I thought I did. People, I mean, people think Rattly is hard to control, which he kind of is, but he basically he's got to know that he bounces around on his own, and he's got to like know when to jump. I guess like knowing how long to hold down the button's a bit tough. And if you get if you go faster into the lava, we can DK coins down there. Kind of obvious. See, like right there. I mean, that's kind of annoying. All right, we're going way up there. I mean, if you don't know how to control Rattly, yeah, this kind of is a tough level. And you gotta <laughs> jump on the bees blind there a little bit. Thank God for the rewind button. I do still want to hear your opinions on the on the save states, especially because a couple of people have complained about that. Especially since this is an unaltered game, this isn't a ROM hack or anything. Fucking acid. Okay, now we should be able to get out of the acid range. Because honestly, it feels like sometimes you have that super jump and then you don't. You barely, you just weren't close enough, apparently. And this is like, this is, this is like, this is the easier part of the level because you're playing squawks who can just kill all this shit and fly above the acid real, really fast. It's like there's a hidden area over here. Oh, come on, I want to be a bonus area. Shit. Is there a bonus area over here, though? No, just letter N. No, no it's nothing special. Once again, missing the bonus areas. I bet some of you are just fuming. Maybe not. Oh, wow, I almost hit that guy there. Alright. Let's keep making our way up. And then I gotta control the spider pretty soon. Clumps of bees gotta get past. I'd say this is like maybe a mini version of Animal Antics. It's not nearly as as frustrating and controller breaking. And like I said, I, I didn't really go through all Animal Antics because it was just too frustrating. I mean, I could probably do it right now. Yeah, with the safe stating, that'd be really easy. But I don't. I won't think that'd be that count. That definitely does not count as beating Animal Antics five save states. Acid. Okay. Now we win. The acid comes up to a certain level. Oh, looks like there's something up there. Of course, I don't get any bonus levels. I mean, I'm pretty sure I've gotten them before, but... It's been a while since i played this game. As I've said many times. Stronghold Showdown. They make it seem as if you're gonna... Final boss is right here. They just give you the Donkey Kong coin, the victory music's playing. Oh, but he was tied to the helicopter. The helicopter which was somehow inside the the tower. There goes K Rule. Flying croc. And do I want to tackle this level now? I don't think I want to tackle this level now. So kind of a short video, about ten minutes long. And we'll see you back next time with Creature Sprint and the final boss if I decide to do it. See you later, folks.